Do you already know the platform that allows users who own a computer to be able to store files and get paid for it? In this video, we'll briefly summarize what Filecoin is, how its platform works and how to mine its filled tokens. What exactly is Filecoin? Filecoin, developed by Protocol Labs, is a decentralized storage network that aims to transform cloud storage into an algorithmic marketplace. It is a very novel and useful platform in that it allows its users to store files, effectively turning their own computer into a database and rewarding them with tokens. Web3, an advanced software development architecture that eliminates centralized control, inspired the Filecoin network. Filecoin can also provide file storage services to other decentralized platforms and facilitate transaction interaction with other blockchain platforms, thereby promoting interoperability. IPFS, a protocol for storing and sharing data on the distributed web, complements Filecoin. That is, all Filecoin nodes are IPFS nodes capable of connecting to and receiving IPLD formatted data from other IPFS nodes via LIBP2P. Both systems are free and open source, with many components in common. How does Filecoin function? The Filecoin ecosystem is made up of three types of entities. Customers are users who pay storage miners to store their files. Users can bargain for storage with any miner on the network, balancing cost, redundancy, and speed by selecting the miner with the best storage offer. Storage miners. Storage miners are computers that are in charge of storing files in exchange for rewards in Phil, Filecoin's native token. Miners are paid only if the network can verify that their service was delivered correctly. Recovery miners. Recovery miners ensure network data recovery. In other words, they are in charge of providing the data that users request. They are not required to commit to storing data or provide proof of storage, unlike storage miners. The Filecoin network is based on storage contracts signed between a customer and a miner. When a client selects a miner to store its files based on its capacity, duration, and price, it reserves enough funds in an associated wallet to cover the total cost of the contract. The storage agreement is published once the miner has accepted the deal. After that, the client prepares the data for storage and sends it to the miner. In turn, the miner packs the data into a sector, seals it, and begins sending proofs to the chain. Once the first confirmation is received, the client is assured that the data has been correctly stored and that the transaction has officially begun. Throughout the transaction, the miner sends continuous proofs to the chain. The miner is penalized if a proof is missing or late. Phil is the Filecoin native token. The Filecoin network's native token, Phil, is currently ranked number 18 in market capitalization. The incentive that Filecoin network users pay for their data to be stored by miners is how we have advanced Phil. The more they pay, the higher the level of security for their files. As a result, Phil is the reward miners receive for community service. The project raised $205 million in an initial coin offering, ICO, in 2017 but the mainnet launch date was pushed back to block 148,888 in mid-October 2020. The maximum supply of the Filecoin token is 2 trillion fill, and there are currently 67,352,494 fill tokens in circulation. Learn how to mine Filecoin. Mining on the Filecoin platform differs from traditional mining on Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. To begin with, the Filecoin network has two consensus mechanisms, Proof of Replication porup, and Proof of Spacetime post, space post. Instead of contributing computational power, miners in Filecoin contribute storage capacity to meet the needs of users, customers who want to store data. In other words, miners serve as databases in the Filecoin ecosystem. They exist in Filecoin. Filled tokens can be traded by five types of users, developers, customers, miners, token holders, and ecosystem partners. There are three kinds of markets, file storage, file retrieval, and token exchange. There are three types of miners. Storage miners. Earn filled tokens by storing data for clients and computing cryptographic proofs to validate storage over time. Unlike Bitcoin miners, the likelihood of earning the per block reward and transaction fees is determined by the amount of storage these miners contribute to the Filecoin network rather than hashing power. Retrieval miners. Earn filled tokens and mining fees for a specific file based on its market value and size. 
The total number of deals they can make is determined by their bandwidth and initial bid, ask time for deals. Minor repair will be implemented in the future. On the network, each Filecoin miner has a power value that is proportional to the amount of space contributed and determines the chances of earning the right to mine a block each epic. Filecoin Reward System Miners on the Filecoin network are rewarded in various ways for their contributions to the network. There are two main types of rewards. Storage Costs Storage fees are the fees that customers pay on a regular basis after reaching an agreement in exchange for data storage and miners sending regular storage proofs to the chain. These fees are automatically deposited into a miner's associated wallet as they complete their tasks and are temporarily blocked upon receipt. Post, proof of spacetime, window checks are performed across the network at 24-hour intervals to ensure that miners continue to host their required sectors as usual. Each day that a miner is not idle, they will be penalized for the failure. Reward Blocks Miners earn rewards and charge fees proportional to the amount of storage space contributed to the network by mining blocks. Winning Post Street is the mechanism for obtaining the right to mine a new block. These rewards, unlike storage fees, do not come from an associated customer, and it is the network that prints new filled tokens as an inflationary measure and as an incentive for miners moving up the chain. Each miner can collect the fees associated with each message included in the block in addition to the block reward. Customers who have been verified. Storage miners can also compete for special offers provided by verified customers who require the miner to guarantee significant data storage to incentivize data storage. Fees for recovery. As recovery agreements are fulfilled, recovery fees are paid incrementally through the payment channels. Penalties, cuts. These are the penalties that miners must pay if they fail to provide reliability to the sector or choose to leave the network voluntarily. These are some examples. Fault slashing fees are paid for each day that a miner's sector is offline and fails to send spacetime evidence to the chain. Sector penalties. A penalty imposed on a miner for a failed sector that was not declared failed prior to a window post street check. Termination fees are a penalty incurred by a miner when a sector is cancelled and removed from the network, either voluntarily or involuntarily. Consensus failure reduction is a penalty imposed on miners who commit consensus failures and act maliciously against the network's consensus. Mining requirements for Filecoin, Phil. There are no minimum requirements for mining Filecoin, but it is currently recommended that your computer have the following features, according to the guidelines on its official website. CPU. The Filecoin team recommends an AMD with more than 8 cores that may support the Intel SHA extension. GPU. A powerful GPU is recommended to significantly speed up SNARK computations. GitHub has a list of GPUs that are supported. RAM. A minimum of 128GB is recommended. Disco. The official Filecoin website recommends a minimum of 1 TB of NVMe-based disk space for caching which should be used to store data during the sealing process, cache Filecoin parameters, and serve as a general temporary storage location. Additional hard drives will be required for final storage of sealed sectors, Lotus chain, and so on. Once you have a computer with these capabilities, you will need to install the Filecoin network client, Lotus, before you can begin storing data from other users and earning fill tokens.